did you ever think you'd get this far? After 35 years of frustration, <laughs> uh, did you ever think that Final Four was uh, uh, in Albion's uh, I, I think I think that down deep, I think we always thought uh, our year would come eventually. I mean, we've been close. The last eight to ten years, we've won a lot of ball games, and uh, I think we we always felt like if we just kept that's always we've always said is just get in, just get to the playoffs, and let's see what we can do. Um, so I, I think all I think down deep we knew we'd make it, but. I have to say, <laughs> it's been pretty frustrating the last what few years. What does this mean for a town like Albion to finally get to a Final Four? I mean, I know it's a small town, and obviously Albion is a town that lives in each town like some of these other little towns. Yeah, uh, I think it means a lot. I mean, we found it, there's a lot of people out there. Uh, they've been playing baseball in Albion for 66 years. So there's a lot of people uh, that have been, have have played with the Tigers, have, have watched Tigers games as a kid. A lot of people uh, that have been going to games for a long, long time, and uh, uh, I think uh, it's nice to put a, you know put Albion on the map just a little bit, I guess, uh, to use a cliche. Okay. It's probably the, the feel-good story for the, for the year after 35 years of not being here. Yeah, well, two years ago when we got there, it was like 40 years, so it's fun to get there, and it, you know, and, and it's it's just amazing how baseball is and, and just play and I, I didn't even exactly know where Albion was until I looked at the map and I heard their field is pretty, it's a little unique so it's going to be fun to go down. As a commissioner, how does it how does it make you feel to see a team like Albion after 35 years trying to get to a Final Four? Wonderful. Every year Matt and I talk about, well I hope we get to see you in the Final Four. The last few years we've been watching the Final Four. This year at least we're both there and we get to play each other and, and I'm just happy second year at Albion. They, They've done a lot of work. They've uh, kept a good solid core together, and they have done a lot of work on their ballpark to make it a fun place to be, to play, and to watch. And, uh, I give them a lot of credit. I, they're they're one of the teams at home talent's all about. Is there any one particular player on your team that you're that you're most happy for finally getting here? Well, yeah, uh, clearly Jim Eastman is is uh, is the is the guy. He's been on the team for 23 years. Uh, he, he, uh, not just as a as a player, as a manager. He's a former manager of the year. He's been an all-star. Uh, he literally kept the team afloat uh, for a few years, playing, managing, fundraising, everything. Um, and I feel so glad for Jim. I think, and I think we all do. You saw it on Sunday when uh, yeah. we just mobbed him. Uh, Jim Eastman is the Albion Tigers, and we feel so happy for him. We all do.